What's happening, everyone? Uh, Thwomp King here. Back at it with season mode. Into the playoffs now with the Detroit Red Wings and I am playing the first round against the Toronto Maple Leafs and here are a list of the teams that have made it into the playoffs you have the Nashville Predators against the Chicago Blackhawks the St. Louis Blues against the Colorado Avalanche Los Angeles Kings against the Anaheim Ducks the San Jose Sharks against the Edmonton Oilers that's the Western Conference and in the Eastern Conference we have the New York Islanders against the Columbus Blue Jackets we have the Pittsburgh Penguins against the Tampa Bay Lightning we have myself as the Detroit Red Wings against the Toronto Maple Leafs and lastly we have the Boston Bruins against the Montreal Canadiens that is the Stanley Cup playoff bracket now in the montage video of the last 17 games I did some simulation and I was and I do have like a last um, clip thing of clips of me trying to come back in certain games that I was down just to see if I could come back and fight my way into the playoffs and if you are still if you haven't like caught up I have made it into the playoffs I don't know how but I fought my way into the playoffs so as you see my season record was 46 32 and 4 and I'll break down the um, I'll go through each division to see where everyone placed I don't think I did that in the, at the end of the montage but I'll go through everything now uh, the Boston Bruins were first seed with a total of 103 points. I came in second. I fought my way into the second spot in the Atlantic Division with 96 points. Toronto ended up with 93, Tampa Bay 90, and Montreal with 90 as well. And in the Metropolitan Division, we have Pittsburgh with 99, the Islanders with 92, and Columbus with 89. And in the Central Division, we have St. Louis Blues with 110 points, the Predators with 96, Chicago with 93 and Colorado with 91 the Pacific Division we have the Sharks at 92 well, I mean I'm sorry that's games played the Sharks with 101 the Kings also had 101 Anaheim had 97 and Edmonton had 94 so in, conclu in conclusion, the Western Conference had teams, had a better ranked teams with the most points. And if I'll go into the entire league, the St. Louis Blues were on top with 110. Then it was Boston, then San Jose and the Kings, followed by Pittsburgh, then Anaheim. 
then myself playing as the Red Wings, then the Predators, then Edmonton and Chicago. So the top 10 teams mainly consist of the Western Conference. So kudos to the Western Conference for having teams with the most points, I guess. But we will get on into the into the game. If you're wondering why the the game said custom, the stock the game style says custom, it's because I edited the goalies to have a 100 all across the board with the reaction speed, the save percentage, and like their whole uh, the. The whole setting for the goalies, the main ones, are at 100 across the board for myself and the computer. And I did not touch the screen, the screen effect or anything like that. The, the only thing that I touched were the reaction speeds and all that to the goalies. But let's get into the game. Not sure why that happened. And they are ready for the opening face off, and so are we. The playoffs the best time of year, and we begin. My camera here, and you'll check next to me. I saw his great work. Oh, my hand. There is a cut, and sure enough, here we go. Oh, that was not good here at all. Awesome. It's coming to you, the following team. These two teams get together, and you can expect. All right then. That was all the CPU with that hit. Thank you. 
No! Are you fucking kidding me? I deked and I put the puck in my own net. Yeah, probably. God damn it. Why weren't you playing over more? Nielsen? God damn. Back the other way. 
That boy Bertuzzi. Great setup from Helm. There is no chance. No chance for the goalie to stop that. Yeah, hopefully I don't deke the fucking puck in my net this time. God damn. Hit the wrong button. I well, it's not like I hit a wrong but hit the wrong button. I wanted to get down on one knee to try and stop them from uh to stop the angle like that. And then I ended up getting the puck on defense and then deked myself into... Oh, I can't believe that happened. So I got eight shots to seven shots. All right. Thank God killed off those two penalties, but let's get the second period underway. I don't know how I did that. Got to see what happened on this replay. You couldn't have given me a better angle to look at. The wings have broken the tie. There was literally almost no room for that puck to go in Another hit that turned into a fight from the computer that was not caused by me. Usually it's been hits that I cause that are starting fights. Thankfully no game misconducts right now.
Oh man. Wow. God. Now yeah, Austin Matthews got nailed. If I get penalties, that's how I'm going to be getting penalties from trying to play defense. Good. Uh, let's see what I can do on the power play in 32 seconds. So I get a five, five on three. What, is that his second goal tonight? I think so. Yep. I want to see if I can get him the hat trick now. Just like shooting out! That's a great save. Toronto's 
been a step forward throughout this contest. The goaltender has saved them so many times. The fact that they're within a stone's throw in this game is kind of a miracle. Goals have to make a half a dozen great stops in a win. This is one on a beautiful move, but there is nowhere for the puck to go. That's his second, too. Let's see if I can get Nyquist when Bertuzzi, either one of them a hat trick or both. I'm going to try. Well, Nyquist, Nyquist got the hat trick. That was a great play from the computer to get into that area of the rebound and put it into the net.
Two periods are in the books here. And the books could very well have some perspiration stains on them right now because these teams have worked pretty hard. But still, a third period is ahead. And we look at a very impressive shots on goal board after two periods. 37 for Detroit and 9 for the Maple Leafs. Toronto's goaltender has had one of those nights. And so this score is lopsided. And we will return after he gets rest and these words. Third period underway. Third period about to begin. The rear view mirror will help us with the first two. And so we'll answer them. Detroit's coach stepped out, told us before the game they want to get off to a good start. And they have in a lot of areas, especially on a scoreboard. They are well in control of this game. Let's see how they play it the last one. Let's see how no team worth its name is going to let that go. It's one of those rivalries. And this No, I didn't even try to hit the goalie. Well, Tavares is done for the night. Took too many shots to the head. Thank you. 
Just carrying it on and utilize. Knock it down out of the air. Shoots. Top right over him and couldn't get it past. His perfect position to go on and shut down that chance. Gardner just playing some courage after being banged up earlier in the shift. No, well. Wow, Nyquist with his fourth goal. With 43.4 left in the third period. Goalie should have been in a better position. Wow, are you serious, Jimmy? Out of all the saves you made and you let that one go in I mean, if he doesn't touch that puck, it bounces off the glass. But no, he had to put up his fucking arm.
So Nyquist gets first star. Tyler Bertuzzi gets the second star with two goals. Dylan Larkin gets third star with one goal and one assist. Jimmy made 10 saves. Their goalie Anderson made 40. They were 0 for 4 on the power play. I was 1 for 2. Alright. Well, we win game one. That's not how I was expecting game one to turn out, but... All right. Next video will be game two of the first round of the playoffs. Thanks for watching. Like and subscribe. And I hope you have a wonderful day. Peace.